all right wonderful people welcome back once again to this wonderful channel i will bring you back to back update and information as the hot in case it's your first time of joining us on this wonderful channel uh don't touch the dial kindly go ahead and subscribe like comment share and also remember to all your notification button so that whenever our news is dropping you will be the first one collect them i don't enter again with you this time <laughs> Make you hear them as they be. I they like to show you this time because uh, as he they do them, he they go. Make you no be like say, and I wait say I just they tell you. No be whining, you no. Know. Uh, the Prime Minister of the Biafra Republic government in exile, Mazi Simon Eba Wanjoku, don't drop another bombshell. He said, When will I uh, make I carry you go? They make you see as that matter they be. No <laughs> be me talking, I wait say I say that. He said, Well, we the Nigerian. Uh, government apologized to me in 2022 as I was preparing to stop Nigeria from conducting um, fraudulent election in 2023. I told you what you need is referendum and not election. You wrote petition to Finland, wrote to EU, wrote to Interpol. You opened online petition against me. Today, what are you doing? Many of you are now praying to God to use Simon Eba and end Nigeria. If you have succeeded in 2022, December, to silence me, who will look up to you today to deal with the Nigerian for you? <laughs> you know, see, I see the, this one, they come from the Prime Minister of the Biafra Republic government to the cyber, this cyber, ever see there. I see that one way they talk, you there for your script there, because that's the idea who will be funny, man. And I see the B. Uh, the man don't talk say he say the Nigerian government supposed to apologize to them personally based on as, uh, how they take uh, handle for 2022. We be say in the try stop uh, the election. We be say the one perform for Nigeria. He say he no say Ojoro go do day for the election. <laughs> say he tell the Nigerian people say waiting they need no be election waiting they need na referendum uh, make everybody follow their own peace go. Uh, but the people know do I'm like that. And he say the people supposed to apologize and say she be today. Some people they pray, say may God help them with the present government. <laughs> you get one state like that too, where one governor don't call prayer. He say make everybody come out and uh, make people pray. So I see they be for that matter. Uh, Nigerian governors don't they call for prayer. Uh, they say na prayer and I ain't go solve the problem where we say it happen for the Obodo. I say, <laughs> I say na prayer and I ain't you na one call. Uh, why you na no bring out the money where you na carry key for bank? Some of these governors, some of them get money for Switzerland Bank and the rest of them. And then they call the citizens, say maybe they come for prayer. And um, made their children, some of them, their children, they for Cambridge, so they are abroad, they study there. <laughs> poor man don't suffer. Everything will happen for this country, and a poor man, they suffer the brunt. Make I carry you, uh, make you see the full detail of that information as it be. They say Nigerian governors calls for prayer, oh, he don't shell it for them. They say Nigerian governors call for prayer as it be. Uh, make you see what's in the sub there now. Governor Sam Bello says prayer remains the best option for prompting peace in Nigeria and for ending the insurgency. It is see they happen. Uh, Governor Abu Bakr Sani Bello of Niger has urged residents of the state to continue praying for divine intervention in Nigeria security challenges. The governor also says prayer remains the best option for promoting peace in the nation as a whole. Mr. Bello said this when he hosted top government functionaries, political office holders, and other to Ifa Emina on Sunday. The news agency of Nigeria reports that the event which drew people of diverse background and culture is aimed at strengthening bond with God as well as with brothers and sisters, particularly in the north, in the month of Ramadan, uh, Bello don't call for prayer. Say, what thing they happen to this country? Say, the only thing where we say go end them, say, I pray and I ain't go end them. Oh. <laughs> I say, okay, when they call us, say, me, they pray, but when I day for a house, they're jolly, they're chilo, dear. <laughs> now, we're supposed to they pray for the governors. Uh, where we say, they no say, now then carry all the money. Put all the money there, put all the money there. <laughs> 
you know one thing about nigeria we say uh if they, they like fun no matter how these uh governments and they are rule really, they pressure us uh poor man go still survive as they be a uh, nigerian squad the bia france especially go still survive as they be see that information where they by your side there you go see what the the prime minister of biafra republic government in exile brgie 2023 human rights activist ceo senior legal advisor at Eba and CEO OY Finnish politician, you see him. <laughs> uh, one thing um, I observe about this present government, where they handle the affairs uh, of Biafra, this government, where they call the uh, Biafra Republic government in exile, is um, their articulation. They are very meticulous in what they are doing, and they are very articulative in what they are doing. Um, looking at the functionaries, the offices, the people that we are selected to function in so many capacities as regards the, the matters that concern the Biafra referendum, you will find out how these people has been, you know, managing the, the affairs. You know, both recently was just the concluded online referendum. And you will look at this kind of people and you will know that these people are learned these people have wisdom these people are people who are going somewhere uh, they are not shaking something like that let's look at what engineer henry chukwemeka is saying engineer henry chukwemeka said now we are in charge to restore the kingdom of heaven on earth <laughs> they watch you maybe see as they be he said resistance was strong in western Igbo land where a series of wars were waged against the british the Ekumeku, who were well organized and whose leaders were joined in secrecy oaths, effectively utilized guerrilla tactics to attack the British. Their forces, which were drawn from hundreds of Igbo youth from all parts of the region, created many problems for the British, but the British used forceful tactics and heavy armament, destroying homes, farms, and roads to prevail the Ekumeku, however, became a great source of Igbo nationalism. Uh, this one and uh, the one where we say it happened. You know, say some of you now we know history go understand say when when white man carry colonization come for uh, Nigeria, come for Africa, especially this our side, come for Biafra land, the Igbo man did not want him. Uh, that was why if you find out some people are of the opinion uh, that the way Nigeria did today, saying a white man nine carry and give to the hand of the Yoruba and the hand of the Alsa man. If you watch them, sometimes it be like saying a true because anytime where they want to do election, uh, you go find out, say, at that time they go, they travel, uh, they go London, they go Paris, they go all those things. I say, if you like saying for this Paris and for this London, now they, they decide the fate of Nigerian man. Oh. <laughs> But he get what he and the kind of talk. He say, if they don't divide this country, say very soon people go they use wheelbarrow to carry money to go buy bread. He be like say, don't they happen small small? Now make we see waiting. Oshi, Oshi Agogo, Ejima said. He said other African countries are more sensible than Nigerian. Most of them are zero intellectual thinkers, but good in noise making and arrogance. One Nigeria will kill them all. Mad people, <laughs> I know follow talk that one. They say mad person, a person where they create. So, my brother, no, they use that kind of word again. You know, good for you. They say the fact prophets are not recognized in their own town does not deplete their efficiency. That's why they carry on their vision and mission. <laughs> I know, say this person they refer to Ahmadike oh, one of Fundibo. Uh, if you have been following Ahmadike one of Fundibo, you will know that all the prophecies he has been dropping, everything is coming to pass in this present administration. Right? Even starting from the administration of uh, Muhammad Buhari, many things happen. Could you believe that uh, the, the central bank say that they does not have, they don't have data for federal uh, federal assets? <laughs> that will tell you the kind of country. Where would they inside? If Namaz and the can Ingo say this country, where ban as one man, oh man, it was quite an English and I gave my quadia. My hand in no deal. Oh, say, Taylor, 
And then one come on, see so on your screen there. Eh, on your corner, but one come on, see so. One come on, see so. Eh, make I show you one come on, see so. Make you see him. Eh, my cast na. The boys na la bal na na la la Alicia ka. Where babo vio? What I go? Eh, eh. My can if one come on, see so. Eh, yeah. My can one come on, see so. Now one come on, see so. So I see the bee. Eh, make I cast take carry you the go. Now we see another information as they be breaking operations of Meet Pitamba business and investment. We are warning the government of Pitamba, the illegitimate governor at PM Mba, to immediately stop demolishing people's houses and homes, or else his entire business will be demolished, not only in Enugu, but make I carry you, make you see as they be. But I say not only in Enugu, but anywhere they are located in Nigeria, you can't be ter terrorizing poor Biafrans and expect the Biafran government to allow you to have peace. I hereby call on Biafran to send a comprehensive list of businesses and structure or investments of Pitamba and location. Send them to info at biafrarepublicgovernment.gov.org. Uh, you don't say, okay. Uh, make we see what in they happen to this, these people. Why did they para? Uh, you know, say they say man they construct for the jungle. Uh, man supposed to they para. Uh, smoking like uh, make I no go the talk. Okay, we will go there. Make I bring the volume for you. The government started the donation. My community is protesting because the government are taking me eighty percent of land of, com of the community. We have allowed them. The committee have agreed to give them two forty-five hectares of lands to take and use. I use it for doing and for them to collect from other community. But they refuse. They want they to refuse, to my brother. They, they refuse. From why are they refusing? And I don't know where. The, where they where they want us to go, so that is why my community is protesting. The government started the demolition. Even right now, right like now, seventeenth uh, of February, they are right now about fifty caterpillar is there demolishing our community, both people's house and crops, everything. I want the government to come for our aid to help us to talk to our governor. Because maybe our government does not know that this such a thing is happening. Where the people of Chitani Chani Ike, Omo Gwen Pulumanya, Ifenemena, Government, Pitamba, Muno Oma Natago Retirement, Na Bae Ben Chataita. Anatago Retirement for the past 11 years. I would have got two Jakurum. Manager, we can go Muna Wunya. Well, to Obelona. I want a puzzle, well, and Naka. Now, break to answer law. Oh, no. That then, now. And I say, I can it within seven days. Then, now, you go. Can government rap no more, no Makana. And the doctor, housing contribution I make. I'm going to run on your line. Mubana, Mubana, Lord. Get a new house to come on. As I'm here, I'm going to make way by the new state government. Now they are quite here. And my yo, my dad is quite new now. Can we have one hanging home now? We need a lot for thirty-five years. Okay. Hey, 
This is happening right in Enugu State, where the government of Pitamba uh, have decided to demolish some areas uh, in some part of Enugu State in order to establish government establishment. And my question is, what is currently going on? Or uh, I thought that uh, we are in democracy, and the governments which are being voted into office are for the interests of the masses. I don't see. Uh, where government will bring up a policy that is going to affect the masses and uh, uh, you know uh, you know take away what they have already look at that poor man the blind man who is crying calling for the help of uh, the government to uh, or the those who are in charge to intervene in this particular matter because things are getting out of hand i say um when i don't see see they be um, you get one song like that where they sing as Yezio Mumene Bulimba, Manamme Hebaro, Onye Yezio Mumene Olu Nochiche, Umuchukwa Ngolea, Onya Jo Mumene Olu Nochiche, Afufuadi Nobudo. Now so it be, we don't see how much they go, but now here, I got to wind down the curtain, and if this is your first time of joining us on this wonderful channel, I'll kindly go ahead and subscribe like comment share and also remember to on your notification button so that whenever our news drop you can see the be the best way we collect them but if you want i feel to read, read some comments where we say you follow this matter where we say it they go now uh, make you know we say like say i can't leave you like this i know read the comment for you oh, make, make i read one or two comments for you uh, make you see as they go make you see make you see uh, the mindset of the people uh, where, where they, they follow reason for this matter where they happen this person say biafra queen she said how can you say your governor does doesn't know that the demolition is going on who gave orders for demolition now biafra queen they talk this one the another another person can't talk uh this way this person now uh, as amaracha as amaracha said uh at uh, pm mba is doing the bidding of apc in Iboland. the fact that the man is meeting out more pains to my enugu people is just sad this one is coming from amaracha then upside said I have never subscribed to a newsletter before, but my friend recommended me the Upside newsletter, and I love it. Uh, this person is trying to advertise their own business. <laughs> uh, Simon, if I don't drop, see what's in the drop. Watch down, you say, Operation Submit Pitamba Business and Investment. We are warning the government of Pitamba, the illegitimate governor at Pitamba, to immediately stop demolition people's houses and homes or else his entire businesses will be demolished, not only in Enugu, but wherever they are found. Uh, this person said, ah, the new bandit of Enugu is playing the template of the Fulani Caliphate, his slave masters. You will hear from Biafrans, Ulu Walemba, Casaladombos <laughs> uh, for the Obodo, Hunger Day, and the government of the day is not even helping matter. Uh, at religious freedom and monitoring bridge, he said Pitamba has made himself a willing tool in the service of the caliphate to the detriment, detriment of Biafrans. He has forgotten too soon that a man that made himself a rat has created entity with a rat. Soro awaits a man that takes side with an offensive forefighter against his own. Uh, that means say person will be say if they stand against his own people, say that person. Uh, they say na abaraka na ega bawa yanya. Daga Daga Gada said he is grabbing land for his Fulani masters, whom he wants to please by building a ranch for their cows. His business needs to be targeted too. I think he is copying from Ozon Danger in Imo State, whose hands are staying in Ibo Youth Obara. Uh, hey, like I say for everywhere, everybody the verse so. Uh, because the way people take the reply go show you say people the vest people know too they happy i bet government make una know what you they do make what you una they do with people uh, because now this kind of thing and they just cause one kind of revolution i say uh, make everybody take a easy um, ne. Oh, phobia, um, ne. Uh, this person said him i am emperor Dian. he said i don't even this kind of biafra you are fighting for <laughs> As simple as this, 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 keep it. this person will be like, say, he know to sabi speak English well, well. I've been no sabi right time. You know, say, you get some kind of reading where you go read your tongue, bo, go bite you straight away. <laughs> um, my people, Dioma, Dioma, mm, uh, you know, say, you get to one woman like that when he came by radio for every day the radio they talk, every day the radio they talk, and uh, the woman can say, radio. 
It be like say this talk where you they talk, you know they tire you. You know they drink water, and I the woman carry carry water go pour for radio. And I saw radio spoil. And I saw it be. Make I just wind down the curtain here, my wonderful people. Thank you, Asi Debbie.